Red ons, red ons. Dit is Radio Delmare. Uit zijn ons laten schippen. Van, we zenden uit van de EG. We zijn losgeslagen van ons anker en liggen vlak voor de Zeeuwse kust. Als u dit hoort, waarschuwt u dan onmiddellijk de kustwacht. Want we zijn in nood. We lopen direct op de rotsen. U kunt het schip nog redden als u wilt. Belt u de kustwacht. Radio Del Mare op 1.9.2. Radio Del Mare. At six o'clock. Good evening. Welcome on board the programmes of Europe's first and only album station. I don't know where this starts. Um, if you were listening just before we came on the air at six o'clock, you may have heard me talking to Mark Jacobs and uh, discussing what was happening outside. We've had Tom Hardy and Case Burrell out in the boat, and here they are. What's all this white stuff on you? What does it look like? <laughs> It looks like about three bags of flour. <laughs> you are not far from the truth. Yeah. And uh, who, who put the uh, flour on them, Johan? <laughs> I'm afraid I did. This is Johan Fischer of Mi Yes. Yeah. A few minutes. But but it was uh, still some sort of a revenge for what happened about six or seven weeks ago. Yeah? And uh, with me it was in fact a bit worse because before putting the flour on me they had some buckets of water. In fact, it was you who did it. <laughs> We've been in the sea! <laughs> oh, but you're not so bad as I am. Well, well, nearly. Was. I, I, don't, I don't think the matter's come to an end because we've got Johan Fischer here that put the flower on Tom and Case, and we've also got Tom and Case <laughs> waiting to get their revenge. We'll let you know what happens. Radio Caroline! The Blackpool lights are on now, nightly to October 29th, for your free Blackpool brochure right today to Bob Battersby, the Town Hall Blackpool FY11LY. Bring the family to see the world famous Blackpool lights. Mayday relay. North Fallen Radio. North Fallen Radio to all ships, all ships, all ships. Following uh, received from uh, Mi Amigo. Following received from Mi Amigo at 1509 Zulu. At 1509 Zulu on 2182 kilohertz. On 2182 kilohertz, shipping water, shipping water, five crew members on board, five crew members on board, request lifeboat assistance, request lifeboat assistance, date time group 191517. This is Caroline on 319, your all-day music station. Goedemiddag, het is twee minuten over twaalf. U luistert naar Radio Caroline op 319 meter, 319. Dat komt overeen met een frequentie van 963 kilohertz. En uh, ik wens u namens alle medewerkers van Radio Caroline een prettig kerst. Good afternoon, or good morning actually. It is really, I suppose, two minutes past 11 hour time, two minutes past 12 cloggy time. This is us. We're back. It really is absolutely incredible to be sitting here um, on this Sunday morning, Sunday afternoon. My mind has not quite got itself together yet. Um, I'm shaking, absolutely shaking, which is uh, something quite unusual for me. 15th is a nice day actually to come back because uh, it's 15 years ago, Easter 1964, that Radio Caroline came on the air and started doing what it's doing now. Uh, our real birthday, of course, uh, sort of celebrated uh, around about the end of March, March 27th, 29th, but uh, this is our official birthday. We have an official birthday, like all queens. Make of that what you will. How does it feel to be back, lad? Fantastic. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. Say something to your friends in Cloggy, go on. Okay, goedemiddag allemaal. Hartelijk welkom. Dit is Radio Caroline. En dat uitzendt op 319 meter van de Middelhof, oftewel de 963 kilohertz. Eén kilohertz opgeschoven zijn we inmiddels en uh, we gaan uh, erg fijne programma's maken, dacht ik. Voorlopig even Tony Allen en daarna uh, zien we wel wat we doen, want we zijn allemaal nog uh, een beetje onder de indruk van het feit dat we terug zijn in de lucht en dat we weer fijne muziek kunnen verzorgen voor uh, iedereen die het maar wil horen. Tony. Hij is goed in de he? Hij is 
Het is precies 12 uur, luisteraars, goedemiddag. Mi amigo, nieuws. Sinds 12 uur deze middag is Radio Mi Amigo opnieuw te beluisteren. En dat op 272 meter middengolf of 1100 kilohertz. De golflengte waarop u hebt afgestemd. Het station dat voor het eerst te beluisteren was op 1 januari 1974... hervatte vandaag 1 juli 1979 zijn uitzendingen vanaf het gloednieuwe zendschip de MV Magdalena. Met de terugkeer van Radio Mi Amigo is de Benelux Radio herboren. Luisteraars, tot zover deze berichtgeving. U bent afgestemd op Radio Mi Amico. Uitzendend van op de vrije golven van de Noordzee. 24 uur muziek. Dit is Radio Mi Amico Internationaal. Welkom, luisteraars in België en in Nederland. Bonjour, chers auditeurs en France. Hello, ladies and gentlemen in Great Britain. Good middag, lieve hörer in Duitsland. Buenos dias, amigos in España. Luisteraars op het evenmaar in Europa. Welkom op de 272 meter. Hier is u weer. Radio Mi Amigo Internationaal. 272 Good morning to you. This is Radio Caroline on 319 meters, 963 kilohertz in the medium wave band. We're broadcasting from the radio ship Mi Amigo. The time is now approaching 8 o'clock. Good morning, now stars. This is Radio Caroline on 390 meters, 963 kilohertz of the Middle Coast, sent out live from the radio ship Mi Amigo, anchored for international gevaren op the North Sea. Tijd is nu precies 9 uur. Loving Radio Caroline broadcasting on 319 meters, 963 kilohertz. Well, we're sorry to tell you that due to the severe con weather conditions and also to the fact that we're shipping quite a lot of water, we're closing down and the crew are at this stage leaving the ship. Uh, obviously, we hope to be back with you as soon as possible, but uh, we'd just like to assure you all on land that there's nothing to worry about. We're all quite safe. Just for the moment, we'd like to say goodbye. Tom? Yeah, it's um, not a very good occasion, really. I have to hurry this because the lifeboat is standing by. We're not leaving and disappearing. We're going onto the lifeboat, hoping that the pumps can take it. Um, if they can, we'll be back. If not, well, I don't like to say it. I, I think, think we'll be back one way or another. Yeah, I think so. From all of us, for the moment, goodbye and God bless. Listening to a test transmission from Radio Caroline on 319 meters 963 kilohertz. Our programs commence at 12 o'clock tomorrow. You're listening to a test transmission from Radio Caroline on 319 meters 963 kilohertz. Our programs commence at 12 noon tomorrow. You're listening to a test transmission from Radio Caroline on 319 meters 963 kilohertz. Our programs commence at 12 noon today. You're listening to a test transmission from Radio Caroline on 319 meters, 963 kilohertz. Our programs commence in precisely nine minutes' time. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Radio Caroline on 319 meters, 963 kilohertz. I'm Tom, and for the next hour, I'd like to take you on a couple of musical journeys through the past two decades. We're going to start with the zombies, and she's not there, and follow that with the yardbirds, with heart full of soul. Caroline on 319. This is Caroline, and if you'd like to write to us, uh, there is an address you can write to, so please do so, if you feel like it. It's Radio Caroline, post box 69504, Los Angeles 90069. Once again, Radio Caroline, post box 69504, 
Los Angeles 90069. Caroline on 319. It's quarter to three, and from myself, Tom Anderson, that's it from me. We're going out with uh, Roxy Music, and then the Psychedelic Furs, and finally, we're going to have a little bit of John Lennon. After that, Andy Archer will be along to play some more music for you. Caroline on 319, it's now three o'clock. Good afternoon, it's nice to be back. What can I say? A nice day. It's about 23 degrees out here. The the sea isn't too bad. Not unpleasant at the moment. And thank you very much indeed for all the people who came out to see us. And especially to Buster and Jean and Don and Teo. Also Norbert and Chris and Keith and Paul. Also John and Steve. Thanks for the champagne. It's Caroline on 319. It's nearly 10 to 6. Let me give you our address. It is... Oh, no. <laughs> It's blown away. I've got it here somewhere. Let me have a look. Radio Caroline, P.O. Box 69504, Los Angeles 90069. That's Radio Caroline, P.O. Box 69504, Los Angeles 90069. We look forward to hearing from you. This is Caroline on 319. You're listening to a special test presentation on 729 kilohertz for 11 meters. We are very interested in your comments and suggestions. Write to MMI, 341 East Madison Avenue, New York, New York, 10017, USA. We're understandably curious about our signal strength and the quality of our signal in your area. We'd also like to know your name, your age, and maybe we could say hello to you at a later date and play one of your favorite records. That address again is MMI, 341 East Madison Avenue, New York, New York, 10017, USA. Keep in mind, these are just tests. The real thing has yet to come. It's uh, 16 minutes to 3. 773. No, 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 no,
Uh, listen, this is just about it for our testing. Yes, we hope very much you've enjoyed the last couple of days. Well, like I say, I hate goodbyes, probably because I really don't know what to say. It's, oh, it's, uh, have a goodbye hate until a little bit later on. We are going to be back. Yeah, we'll be back in uh, oh, 10 days to a couple of weeks. And, and when we do come back on there, you'll probably notice the uh, signal stake will be up a fair bit. So uh, if you have any problems at the moment, sir... Uh, <laughs> receiving us in a couple of weeks' time, you will have no problems at all. I can guarantee None at that. All. So we look forward to your company, maybe not on 729, but uh, you keep tuning around this uh, same area of the uh, medium wave and you'll definitely find us. So on behalf of everybody here on board the radio ship, the communicator, the captain and the crew, uh, from me, Johnny, and also from... Blake Williams, and these are my final few words. Mm, and these are my final few words. We'd both like to say goodbye. Should we hit this one more time here? Yeah. Go okay. Attention on shipping. The Met Office is here to find the warning for shipping. This is Radio Caroline. It's now four o'clock. Radio Caroline News, brought to you by Newsweek magazine. Good afternoon, Europe. The cultural attaché to the British Embassy in the Greek capital, Athens, has been shot dead. And finally, it was on this date in 1964 that Radio Caroline first broadcast to the peoples of Europe. On March the 28th, 1964, Radio Caroline brought millions of listeners their first taste of all-day music. From a former Danish ferry boat, renamed the motor vessel Caroline, from an anchorage three and a half miles from the coast of Frinton on sea in Essex. And for Radio Caroline, I'm Jay Jackson. That was Radio Caroline News, brought to you by Newsweek magazine. <laughs> Laser, punt en Good morning. I'm Rick Harris, and on behalf of David Lee Stone, Jesse Brandon, Steve Masters, Joe Young, Tim Levenseller, Bill Voigt, Dennis Legier, David London, Michael Wilson, and about four dozen other people, I'm pleased to introduce you to a brand new radio station, All Europe Radio, Laser 558. Broadcasting live from international waters on the MV Communicator, we promise to bring you at least 54 minutes of international hit songs each hour we broadcast. All hits, all the time. Plus, we'll keep you informed of the news of the world hourly. Again, speaking for all of us, welcome to Laser 558, where you're never more than a minute away from music. Starting now. Laser 558. Laser 558. Where you're never more than a minute away from music. Laser 558. The home of the hits. Laser 558. Where the hits keep coming. This is Laser 558, where the hits keep coming. This is All Europe Radio, Laser 558, broadcasting live from the MV Communicator in international waters. Laser 558 is owned and operated by Eurad SA and broadcasts in a totally free environment. At all times, this radio station endeavors to maintain standards of good taste and responsible technical operation. We will resume our transmission of hit music this morning at 5 o'clock. Thanks for listening today, and have a good night. From the MV Communicator in International Waters, we are Laser 558. <laughs> By your ad SA. This is free radio with non stop hit music practicing good programming and technical standards. We are Laser 558. The hits fun it all, Bob. Put it back. Laser. Like a Radio Laser. Like a Laser. 558. Five, Laser 558. Five,
is Caroline. It's 7.30 in Central Europe. In Britain and Ireland, it's 6.30. Direct from the Caroline Newsroom, tonight's top stories in brief. Brought to you by Newsweek Magazine. A British registered oil tanker has been attacked in the Persian Gulf. The British renown was not badly damaged and is sailing to Dubai. The French president, Francois Mitterrand, has called for all parties involved in the Arab-Israeli conflict to join in a conference to seek an overall Middle East settlement. He made the call during his current visit to Jordan. And, um, Tom, do you remember a couple of months ago I told you about a chap called Tim Batstone who was going to windsurf around the coast of Britain calling in at all the lifeboat stations? I do indeed. You do, right. Well, the good news is he completed it this afternoon. He's uh, made a 2,000-mile journey around the British coast, as I say, stopping off at every lifeboat station. He did it, and it took him, I think, 58 days. Uh, it went up to 90 miles some of those days. He's raised £40,000 for Britain's lifeboat service, which, of course, is wholly voluntary. All I can say is, what an amazingly good cause to do it for. It certainly is, isn't it? So, uh, Tim Batstone, who's no doubt celebrating tonight, somewhere in Essex. Congratulations, matey, and I'm, I'm sure there's a lot of lifeboat people tonight and supporters of the RNLI who are very, very proud of you. As long as they don't go, go out and get drunk and celebrate too much, um, everything's all right. Congratulations I from all of us on board. Tell you something, he was seasick, apparently, for the first week. <laughs> <laughs> the wind today, he could get quite a long way, I should think. Mm. Here's one that I know you would like, Jay. Santana and Samba Party. Live from the North Sea on 963 kilohertz with love and the very best in music, this is Caroline 319. It's 7 o'clock. We just heard Flash in the Pan and Hey St. Peter, Berlin before that, When We Make Love, and Fleetwood Mac with a Caroline classic. Sarah, of course, comes from the album Tusk. If you've just joined us, a very good evening to you. And welcome to the North Sea from Caroline. If you'd like to drop us a line here on Caroline, the address is very simple. It's Radio Caroline, New York, double one five one eight in the USA. And while you're about it, how about telling us what you think Loving awareness is all about. This is Ijar Man, and are we a warrior? I guess so, in our way, a warrior of love from the North Sea. It's Caroline, Europe's voice of loving awareness. Radio Caroline. Music into the 80s. Play music just for you. With love, peace, and good music. From a point of sea to the circles in your mind, this is the new Radio Caroline. Loving awareness is free, is free, is free, is free, 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 free. Radio Caroline News, brought to you by Newsweek Magazine. That was Radio Caroline News, brought to you by Newsweek. 
the international news magazine. Caroline. Radio Caroline. The legend lives on. Overdrive. Throughout the night on 963 kilohertz, this is Caroline Overdrive. David Lee Stone here. Tonight I celebrate my love with a case of beer and a big bowl of popcorn. Ten minutes until five now, Laser 558. The hopelessly romantic David Lee Stone here with Roberta Flack and Peebo Bryson. Just for those of you who are in love this afternoon. And our Some Days Are Better Than Other award goes to another gentleman who should have stayed in bed. Uh, this, this item comes from San Diego. A thief broke into a house, dropped a stereo set when a dog began to bark, lost his sneakers as he started to run away, charged into a parked car, and broke his nose. This is a true story. Broke his nose and hurt his knee. <laughs> I've never heard of anybody running into a parked car. Got up to dust himself off, stumbled, hit his head, vaulted over a fence. This isn't clear. I don't know how he hit his head and vaulted over a fence, but at any rate, he did all this. Well, in the matter of just a few seconds, I, I imagine, hit his head, vaulted over a fence, and landed in the midst of a pack of dogs who bit him on the buttocks and legs. Ooh, ooh, what a rough day. Well, just uh, shows to go you. Crime doesn't pay. I got Attention laser lovers. Send for your own laser sticker kit from Music Media in New York. You'll receive colorful laser stickers, a numbered communicator club card, making you eligible for prizes announced on laser, and a communicator club badge, all with a blue and yellow international signal flag used at sea, which means I want to communicate with you. Send your name and address along with two pounds sterling, nine guilders, or the equivalent in your currency to Music Media International, 341 Madison Avenue, New York City, 10017, USA. If you already have a communicator card, send half as much. Allow four weeks for delivery. Again, that's Music Media, 341 Madison Avenue, New York City, 10017, USA. Order your laser sticker kit today. Right on, right on. Eight minutes now in front of five and Sade, smooth operator. The long version on laser. Well, being the smooth operator that I am, I'm just going to slither on out of here. Jesse Brandon is up next. Have a great weekend from Laser 558. It's pretty politi. David Lee Stone, Stone slithering out, so Jesse Brandon sliding in. Slithering out. My God, he's feeling feisty tonight. But it is a Saturday, so hey, that makes sense. I tell you, it's not so bad getting up five minutes before my show if I have been up all night and slept all day. But when I'm up all night, up all day, and then take a one-hour nap, it feels like there's this little overcoat on my tongue. And it's not so much the way it feels as the way it tastes. Oh. <laughs> Barbara Streisand, I'm coming right behind this. If you're a skier on top of the world or just happy to make it to the bottom, you'll find a friend in America's Ski Magazine, the most important piece of ski equipment you can buy. Olympic and World Cup champions Phil and Steve Mayer are among the editors of Ski Magazine. So you know skis, racing, and instruction coverage is the best. Subscribe now, and you'll also get the pocket guide, How to Ski It Right, packed with more than two dozen ski technique tips, the kind of great ski instruction that you get in every issue of Ski Magazine. That's eight big issues, plus your free ski pocket guide, all for just 11 U.S. dollars and 94 cents. Send your name and address today, along with a mail order in U.S. funds, for $11.94 to Ski Magazine, 380 Madison Avenue, New York City, 10017 USA. That's Ski Magazine, 380 Madison Avenue, New York City, 10017, USA. Are you a radio laser 558? Dit is het verkeer, 369 meter. 963 kilohertz, zo was het, nee, uh, 319 meter. Er zat een verkeerde kaart in, want wat je had moeten horen was het tijd zijn. Maar dat is geen probleem. Het is tenslotte live en we hebben golven zat om ons te vergezellen. Je luistert naar Radio Monique Internationaal. Op 51 graden, 40 minuten noordenbreedte, 1 minuut, 33 seconden en 2 oosterlengte. Dit is Radio Monique. Het is 2,5 minuut over 12. Goedemiddag, miljoenen, want dat mogen we rustig stellen. Je luistert naar de eerste officiële uitzending van de Radio Monique, een station voor de hele familie. 
in de lucht van 5 uur in de morgen tot 8 uur in de avond met voldoende muziek, voldoende informatie, want dat bieden we je allemaal aan. En wie zijn we? Om maar een paar namen te noemen, Rob Hartholt, Maarten de Jong, Jos van der Zanden, Frits Koning, Ad Roberts en Ron West. Dat zijn de discjockeys die live van boord alle informatie bij je thuis brengen. En daar ging de champagne, want zoiets moet gevierd worden. Radio Monique is het station voor jou. Satelliet schijnt. top 200 over this Easter weekend as Caroline celebrates 21 years of broadcasting to you. 11 after 10 o'clock this Easter Sunday morning from Caroline. Jay Jackson with you here till 12 o'clock. And at 12 o'clock I shall be handing over to part 2 of the 200 to Simon and he'll be taking you through to 3. Now let's see who's won one of those giant Radio Caroline posters. The Caroline posters have the all-time top 500 listed on them. They also have a fantastic photograph big colour photograph of the home of Radio Caroline, the motor vessel, the Ross Revenge, and also pictures of rock bands that Caroline's made and played over the years. Ray Lester of Meadow Drive, Bartham on Humber in South Humberside. Ray, cheers to you later, matey. I'll get down to answering that on the air next Sunday when we're back to normal. Ha <laughs> ha. But for the meantime, will you accept from us as an Easter gift and a way of saying thank you for your support over the years, one of our giant posters. If you will, we'll send it off to you in the next few days. That's Ray Lester, Meadow Drive, Barton on Humber in South Humberside. It's one, another of our giant Radio Caroline posters. 1024, Easter Sunday, 1985. When we look back over some of the names that in the past have worked for Radio Caroline, and remember people like Errol Bruce. What a huge chap he was. And Jerry Burke, the man with the beard. The man who took care of Caroline News in the 1960s, Jerry Burke. Carl Conway. Carl's still around today doing a little bit of radio work at weekends. And uh, we say good morning to you, Carl, and I hope things are nice for you in Kent at the moment. To Gordon Cruz and the Admiral Robbie Dale. Of course, Robbie now working very hard for himself in Dublin. Let the love in the world... Oh, hi, uh, this is uh, Charlie Wolf. Laser 558 is on, my friend. And, of course, big news. I don't know if, if you've seen it yet. There's two ships in the North Sea. I should know. I work for the DTI. We were working the day watch out of the dio dioptic surveyor. <laughs> I can't go on with this. <laughs> Yes, we have a license to do, um, I don't know. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> oh, my, I don't know if I, can I, can, I'm going to read this. Read it. Read it. I don't know if I, I don't know if I can keep a straight face. All right, here we go. This is where your money is going. Yeah, uh, this is the, to, to see fact? No, to, to, to dioptric. Uh, I'm going to read uh, the BBC story first, because they mention our name first. Channel 4 is mentions uh, Caroline's first, so I, I'm them. Okay, this is from BBC CFAX, uh, on page 116. Take notes, you free radio enthusiast. I'm sure you'll want to have all this done. A ship chartered by the government dun, 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 is monitoring the Thames estuary as part of a crackdown on pirate radio. Uh, the ship will monitor broadcasts from Radio Caroline. Who are they? Oh, that's, that's our friends across the way. 
and laser 558. Uh, and um, let's see what else does it say here. And watch for illegal deliveries of supplies. Broadcasts from these stations are not illegal, of course not, as the vessels are moored in international waters. But it is an offense to supply or support the ships. Well, Juan's going to be really... I know. Do you know how long it's taken me to learn Spanish? You're going to add a note to every word. Hello, all. A Department of Trade spokesman said there was a... Now, dig this one. Quote, potential threat to life caused by radio interference. They always use these... I guess they've been doing this for 20 years now, using words like possible... Potential. Alleged. Alleged. You know, it, it is true because I, I stubbed my toe once. Here we go. This is this is this is Channel Four, uh, page five hundred nine for all of you uh, statisticians. A ninety-nine foot surveillance ship is in position. The ship will monitor broadcast from Radio Caroline. How can I get first bill and laser five five eight and watch for illegal deliveries of supplies? Juan is going to just have a fit. The Department of Trade said. Now this is the one I love. These robbers of the airways. Oh. Oh. Um, I've, I've always said nice things about you guys, too. Robbers of the air. We're interfering with aeronautical and marine navigation equipment. Where? Where? When? Hope you folks aren't believing any of this. Besides legitimate stations, we've been messing with them, too? No. Well, I mean, I, I hung out... I, You're the guy that instituted B-Bade. I know. I know. This is... I am... I am just B-Bade now. Yeah, B-Bade is over. History. You know, I mean, yes. the, the only thing I've ever done to a legitimate station was I, I was standing out in front of Capitol Radio once and was going... Hey, little girl, come on over here. <laughs> uh, rescue helicopters might not be able to use uh, equipment, it says, in an emergency. And Caroline and Laser were... Here's another one. Posing a grave... Big word... Potential threat to life. Wait a minute. They can't use it. Are they blaming us for their faulty equipment? I guess. I don't know. This is all. They're spending the taxpayers' money to like yeah. to do this instead yeah. of buying their helicopters. This is this is okay. this. You know, and, and all I have to say to these guys, of course, is, oh. Oh. no. This is this is you know. Well, anyway. Uh, <laughs> how long? You see what they've done? You know what they've done to us? They've upset us. And they've kept us over a minute away from oh. music. <laughs> we'll have fun tonight. Is, you may want to listen, because this is... Charlie Wolf tries out for the old Bailey. I don't know. <laughs> I hope they come over and visit, though, because, uh, you know, we'd be glad to share, you know, some food with them at the Dioptric Survey. You guys, I know you're monitoring us tonight, and um, I'd like to say hello, and I know that you're just doing your job, but, but next time you see your boss, go... Laser 558. Good morning, I'm Joe Nell on All Hit Radio. This is Laser 558 with hits of the ganze Welle. U bent afgestemd op Laser, Europa Radio 558. And this is Charlie Wolf, and I'll tell you, this is a, a very nervous moment here for me, because what I'm about to say is... Uh quite heavy duty, and I don't know if I've ever taken a stand like this before. This is no small potatoes like, uh, like the DTI, and, um, I hope you'll bear with me. I know this could be kind of, you know, it's boring because it's not music, but I hope you'll, you'll bear along with me here. As you've probably heard the last couple days, I've been really bothered about people taking drugs, and, um, Thompson Twins have a new song out called Don't Mess With Dr. Dream. It's about, uh, not messing with heroin, and I was just reading an article here, and I really just felt moved to to say something. This is from about a week ago, uh, the 23rd of August, uh, International Herald Tribune, on page two, drug war, British seek the right language, it says. And it says here that the drug problem in Britain is going through the roof. And part of the problem is no one knows how to communicate to kids and put it in the right words. It's talking about how this advertising campaign is going on and and how these people are trying to put the... They, they, even in here, they can't say it. Well, all right, I'm going to say it. I, just, I, I don't believe in swearing. I, 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 well, I, I, I do say the, the odd cuss word, but I've, I've never really, you know, enjoyed it. But it says here that you've got to talk to kids on their own level, and you've got to put it right to them in, in unabashed language. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be the anarchistic radio station that we are. I'm going to get in a heap of trouble for this. And if uh, you don't like listening to swearing on, on the air, tune out for about just uh, 30 seconds and come back, okay? 
Uh, and I apologize if I uh, offend anybody, but uh, I want to put this in terms that can be understood. Okay, kids, uh, young, uh, you mind if I call you kids? Okay. Anybody that's prone uh, could possibly take drugs, especially heroin, or those that are taking heroin. I don't take the stuff. I did take drugs for a while. And then I quit. And uh, I'll put it right to you, okay? Heroin fucks you up. You dig? The stuff is shit. Stay off of it. Very interesting article here uh, about how they're trying to stop this stuff. And uh, I, I want to uh, say hello to all the people at, at uh, Yellowhammer, which is an ad agency in London that I guess is spearheading the advertising campaign to get kids off of drugs. And uh, I hope you guys at Yellowhammer will get a hold of us because I'd really like to help out. And I mean, I really do mean that. If you're on drugs, get off this stuff, please. See, the people at Yellowhammer must be a real nice advertising agency. It's in London. And they're probably saying, well, gee, we'd like to do something, but, you know, there's the Marine Offenses Act. And I don't really give a heap about the Marine Offenses Act, especially when it comes to a situation like this, because I, I really feel very strong about this, uh, seeing people get messed up on drugs. You know, take the Marine Offenses Act and throw it out the window, because I really just don't care. I, I, I'm... I care a lot about the, the people that listen to this radio station. I think are the neatest people in the world, and I do care about you, okay? And, uh, and, and I, I say this from the bottom of my heart. I know what it's about because I've, I've done my share of it, and I got off the stuff, and you should too. And if you are off of it, never, ever touch that stuff, please. <laughs> Okay, special, special report from the Situations Room concerning uh, the Euro siege as we are in day 23. We thought something was going on. We're, we're not quite sure. Uh, some of the lights went out on, uh, on their boat, but, uh, but they, they still have power, I guess, because their, their radar antenna is still going on the, uh, on the Dioptric Surveyor, and, and some of the lights are on, but a lot of the navigation lights are off. And we, we I don't know what to make of it, but uh, and, and especially their anchor light. Their anchor light, very important to South. Any ships should be in our area. Uh, please be careful. The Dioptric Surveyor is sitting between the Ross Revenge and the uh, Communicator, which is our ship. So if there's any, like, uh, oil tankers coming on through and you plan on passing through the two ships, be careful because the Dioptric is there. And, and I sure, uh, you know, hate to see you go and, and you know, ram those guys because they're friends. You know what I mean? Laser 5 8 31 in the U.K. It's uh, 931 on the continent. And we've been doing it. Oh, ball, boy, oh, boy. Uh, laser 558 five, on. Madonna's getting into the groove on Laser 558. Five, oh, and in case you were wondering, uh, we, uh, we won't be hooking up with Chipping Sodbury Sound tonight. That's the, the radio station that's hired me because uh, I'll be leaving Laser, uh, uh, well, about three weeks to a year, depending on when the DTI pulls out. <laughs> but when I go on holiday next time, I will not be coming back. But uh, I'm very happy to report that uh, they've hired me at uh, Chipping Sodbury Sound. And I've been supplying with, uh, them with programming, about an hour's worth a night, uh, via the Laundrasat communication satellite. Luckily, at Chipping Sodbury, I have the weekends off. They know how to treat their people decently, you know what I mean? <laughs> and, and that in the, in the Laundrasat communication satellite is, is still being repaired by the uh, astronauts on the U.S. space shuttle. So, I mean, we couldn't go on tonight, even if we wanted to. Time now for a laser spotlight song. Miami Sound Machine. A bad boy. Laser 558. Oh, you're pretty. Laser 558. Charlie Wolf. I, I don't know if you can feel it on land. Can you feel it? Huh? Can you? Yes, the, the tide is changing. And when, when tide changes and your boat kind of goes around before it, it gets back into the tide, well, it, it, it rolls and pitches and stuff. And, and it's an ominous night out tonight. And the Dioptric Surveyor, the spy boat, is bouncing all over the place. I was just peeking at them through the, uh, the starboard side portholes. I'm, I'm on the port side of the ship, so I went across to the starboard side, speaking at a porthole, and they're bouncing all over the place. Oh, those boys, they're going to get sick tonight. <laughs> Have a pen or pencil ready. And remember, satisfaction is always guaranteed by Top Tracks. 17 minutes past the hour now. This is Craig Novak, and uh, a special message now. <laughs> Well, let me tell you, for those who might be interested, uh, Yankee 3 is zero. Uniform, repeat uniform, Romeo 2, repeat Romeo 2. November, repeat November, channel 16, listening. 13 before the hour on Laser 558, a uh, repetition of this fine message we have. Uh, Yankee, all Yankee 3 are zero. Uniform, repeat uniform, November, repeat November, 
Romeo 2. Repeat Romeo 2, Channel 16, listening. Live from the North Sea on 576 kilohertz, this is Radio Caroline International. It's 12 o'clock midday. Radio Caroline News, brought to you by Newsweek magazine. Good afternoon. The offshore radio ship MB Communicator, home of Laser 558, sailed from the Nocte Channel today, escorted by the British government surveillance vessel Guardline Tracker. The communicator had been plagued by generator problems since yesterday, and after a night of heavy storms on the North Sea, the government vessel took up position alongside the ship earlier today. It isn't yet known if the communicator had asked for assistance or if the authorities boarded the vessel. Both ships are now believed to be heading for Harwich on the east coast of England. The crew of the Guardline Tracker would not comment on whether or not the action they had taken was on the authorization of land-based officials. With a look back at Laser's time on the North Sea, Andy Johnson. Laser 558 was one of the most successful offshore radio stations to challenge Europe's land-based broadcasters since the first such station took to the high seas in 1958. Its programs of non-stop hit music at one time had an audience of over 8 million listeners, but from the time later arrived off the east coast of England until today, the station was plagued with technical problems. The original plan to broadcast using an aerial suspended from a balloon flown above the radio ship communicator, previously a surveillance vessel called Guardline Seeker, was soon abandoned in favour of the more traditional transmitter masts. And despite its massive audience, Laser never achieved the same measure of success in gaining advertising. Nevertheless, the station was seen as such a threat by Britain's independent local radio operators who found their listeners deserting in droves to the brash American newcomer that they put pressure on the UK government to silence both Laser and her neighbour Caroline. The government surveillance vessel took up station in the Knock Deep Channel of the North Sea where both ships were anchored. The authorities claimed both stations were supplied from England in contravention of legislation passed in 1967 designed to silence offshore radio once and for all. In fact, both Laser and Caroline tendered from Spain. Last night's storms, coupled with a lack of cash and ever-increasing generator problems, finally proved too much, and Laser's brave attempt to shake up European broadcasting came to an end. It is ironical that the government ship, Guardline Tracker, which escorted Laser to Harwich, was once upon a time a sister ship to the communicator. Thank you very much, Andy. Loving Nearly five to nine, Caroline 558 for Christmas Eve, 1985. And we, well, sadly, finish up with a, on a rather sombre note this morning, after, what, nearly 22 years of broadcasting, Caroline's made many, many friends through its listeners. Some come and some go, and some have been with us for, well, from the very beginning. And news reaches us today of uh, one Caroline listener that Caroline will always hold a very, very special place in its heart for but sadly he has passed away and is no longer with us. To millions, he was just known as Buster. God bless you, Buster. We know you are out there. We are here, please, with Bruce. This is Laser Hot Hits, and I am John Rock and Roll Anthony. I'd like to send out my sincerest and most gratitude thanks to my buddy John, James, and Mike. They are the main wire twisters who crank us back up, got us rocking and rolling on the airways of all Europe. They are our wire twisters, the brewers of Laser Blast, and also the brewers of their own home beer. I think we might put that in a bottle and call it John Rock and Roll Beer. I don't know. I'm going to have to get the, the uh, patent from them and see if we can make up a little bit. Here's Pride and Love. Once again, John James and Mike, my sincere gratitude to you, twisting the wires, getting his baby back, rock and rolling one more time, and I am John Rock and Roll Anthony, taking you into a, a Monday night, I found out what day it was just a little bit ago, ten minutes after nine o'clock, we're going to give you an address, coming up just a little bit, so you can actually write and say hi if you like, right now, Jackson's a cool baby, I want you back, a laser hot hit, speed that right into your brain, laser is back, and I am John Rock and Roll Anthony, you're going to be hearing a, a whole bunch of me in the next couple of days, being that I'm the only jock afloat right now, so hey, we are going to have so much fun. If you want to scribble something down and say hi, write it to Laser Radio and care of me, John Rock.
Rock and Roll Anthony, 515 Madison Avenue Suite, 3600 New York, 1022. It is the right time to tell a friend that Laser Hot Hits is back. That's right. No more boring radio. The only fun station in all of Europe is back doing it to you. That's right. You, you, and you, and you. Everybody put your hand up to the radio. I want you to feel something. Move. Rainbow, since you've been gone. Laser Hot Hits. Good evening. You're up. 935, John Rock and Roll Anthony, Laser Hot Hits. Back and we are rocking and non stopping all night long. ZZ Top, three men from Texas, two of them with the funny beards, and one of them kind of looks like a normal person. Don't know how he got mixed up with those other two. Give me all your loving laser hot hits. We're back a couple minutes before 10 o'clock. Make that 12.58 for the digital freaks on the outside. John Rock and Roll Anthony taking you into a laser hit first night. Can you hardly stand it? That's right, we got the hottest hits all over the nation. Right now, Slap Arch. Let's go all the way, all the way to number one. We'll see you up there. Thank you very much. Returning to your radio set. Laser is back. Program details will be announced soon. Go tell a friend. Tell him Laser is back. And stay tuned to this channel. One minute after 12 o'clock, John Rock and Roll Anthony here. And, uh, well, uh, we're, we're, we're going to take a slight pause here. Uh, we got a whole bunch of things. Uh, we got to twist a few more wires and cool down a few things. Infractions, detractions, cracks, and crustaceans, and all these other things that have been going on. We have got more people huddled around our transmitters downstairs in the bottom of our laser boat than, uh, than anybody can possibly ever deal with. And we're not even giving anything away free right here, but we got people down there that are just working and working and working and working and working and working and uh, they're going to get everything coming back to normal. All you got to do is just stick it right here. Hot hits. 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 It's four minutes now after six o'clock. John Rock and Roll Anthony, and you're saying, where is this coming from? Why is my radio making this spectacular noise? Well, let me tell you, my friends. I want you to tell a friend, too. Laser Hot Hits is back. You know it. We are going to be here all the time, stronger than ever, rocking and rolling. Until we get you where we want you. Good morning to you. If you are out there in our shouting distance, I'll let you know that it is eight minutes now after six o'clock. And if you can hear us in any way, shape, form, or manner, we love you forever. We also want to hear from you. Write down this address if you can focus on a piece of paper this early in the morning. Laser Radio, 515 Madison Avenue, Suite 3600, New York, 10022 USA. We love you for getting up and getting off with a laser hot hit. Here's Marvin Gaye. Heard it through the grapevine. I would like at this point to say hi to Mel and the gang from Brighton. They are the ones who twisted everything together out here originally to get everything started. You guys, just like magicians, love ya. Little Steve Miller, Abra Kadabra, Laser Hot Hits. Good morning. Your music station, Laser Hot Hits. From the MV Communicator, anchored in the international waters of the North Sea, we are Europe's hottest hits. AM 576, Laser Hot Hits. Hits. Maximum power, AM 576, Laser Hot Hits. Hi, this is Samantha Fox on Laser Hot Hits, wishing you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Laser Hot Hits, 576. Laser Hot Hits. More music on Laser Hot Hits. Laser Hot Hits All Hit Radio The hottest hits on AM 576 Laser Hot Hits No, 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 nobody plays a better variety of music Laser Hot Hits Nobody Laser Hot Hits More hits Back, 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 back to back Laser Hot Hits the new music authority, AM 576. Laser Hot Hits. Laser Hot Hits. And now, another commercial free music suite. Blasting out across the nation, Laser Hot Hits. While the others are talking, we keep on rocking. Laser Hot Hits. Laser Hot Hits. AM 576, Laser Hot Hits. Turn it up loud and rip off the knob. Hottest Hits. Laser Hot Hits. 
And a very, very good afternoon to you, just as you were beginning to think we'd gone away. We pop back, Caroline 558, back on your radio, back with all the good music across Europe. And have I got a lot to tell you? You better stay listening. Things will unfold. 1.33 to time from Caroline 558, and the music never stops. We'll go west and we close our eyes. Something we all did a lot of last week. Good afternoon to you, Sergeant Harris, by the way. Europe's favourite music station, Caroline 558, back in business yet again. And 90 minutes past two, Barry White's still going strong, so I see. It's the 4th of December today. When you're off the air, you lose all track of time. Christmas is nearly here. Sing. This is Radio Caroline, broadcasting on 6210 kilohertz in this 49-way major band. from the Gulf Revenge, anchored in the international waters of the North Sea. We will be suspending transmission on this frequency for a period of 30 minutes at 12 o'clock English time. And listening for reception reports on this and adjacent frequencies. This is Radio Caroline, broadcasting on 6210 kilohertz from the Big Red Lady, anchored in the international waters of the North Sea. We will be suspending transmissions on this frequency as of now for a period of 30 minutes. And listening for reception reports on this and adjacent frequencies. This is WLR calling Radio Caroline on 6210 kilohertz shortwave. Don't hold it long. Your signal here in Dublin, in Ireland, was 20 dB over 9. That's 20 decibels over 9. A very strong signal indeed. And no problems with, of course, audio. This is WLR calling Radio Caroline. Well, we're going to thank everyone that came back to us. This is Radio Caroline, and I'm Mike Watts. The reason we've delayed returning to the air is that we just had so many calls. It was unbelievable. Uh, a lot of you didn't get through in full. Um, the conditions here are not particularly good. They are bouncing up and down, rather. And uh, But we did manage to get uh, several stations' uh, reports. Um, certainly logged in stations from Dublin. Um, one from Dublin, one uh, identifying, identifying itself as Boyneside Radio. Uh, Delta Tango uh, 6280, we heard you. Uh, we unfortunately cannot queue, so this is broadcast transmitter and it's extremely difficult to do a queue, so with it. Um, Delta Radio, I believe, who are in, uh, possibly in Holland. Uh, I heard a station in Scotland, one in Jutland, uh, one from Italy and uh, one from Antibes in France as well. Uh, also, thanks to everyone who tried to contact us but failed to do so because of pure or uh, propagation conditions. We, uh, we could hear so many stations, but most of them were extremely weak and unreadable. But uh, stay tuned to Caroline. Uh, we're now returning to Caroline 558, uh, the medium wave station, and relaying the output of that on this frequency. This is Radio Caroline from the North Sea on 6210. Mission Radio, Box 346, Corona, California, zip code 91719, USA. Weltmissionsradio, Postfach 346, Corona, California, 
91719, Vereinigte Staaten von Amerika. You're listening to Caroline 558, your 24-hour music station. In order to carry out essential engineering and technical reorganization to bring you a better service on 558 and a new station on 819, it's necessary for Caroline to suspend daytime transmissions from Saturday for a period of about one month. After this time, Caroline will return to 558 24 hours with a better service than ever before. During the next month, a Dutch language music station can be heard on 558 during the day, with Caroline continuing unaltered throughout the night. So stay tuned to 558 for the best in 24 hour music radio. The mail begins in five minutes' time. This is for Jeanette from Steve Irwin van der Bleek in Dutch next. See you at six. Bye bye. <laughs> Europa, een goede morgen. Het is 9 uur precies. Dit is live vanaf de Noordzee. Een Nederlandstalige testuitzending op 558 kHz AM. Bij u tot 7 uur vanavond met alleen maar de allerbeste muziek. Een van de dingen wat wij hier gaan doen op 5 en overdag is het Nederlands product ondersteunen. Daar begonnen we gelijk krachtig mee. De nieuwe satellietschijf. Je hoort haar elke week, de hele week lang, de satellietschijf. Deze week is het Mariska van Kolk en You're As Cold As Ice. Europa, goedemorgen. Daar zijn we dan op 558 kilohertz. Tot 7 uur vanavond brengen we hier de allerbeste muziek in deze testuitzendingen. Mijn naam is Eder van der Bliek. Ik ben bij u tot 12 uur. Jumbo Records and Tapes acknowledge the assistance from Monitor Magazine, Gary Hogg and Anorex UK, Chris Edwards, Charlie Wolf, Chris Tully, JR, Glenn Fraser, Tom Anderson, Paul Scripps and Ian Goddard who supplied archive recordings that were used. Produced and edited by Bill Rollings, the executive producer was Ray Anderson. Another 10 years of offshore radio is just one in a series of offshore radio documentary records, tapes and videos available from EAP. For further details, please write East Anglian Productions, Studio House, 21 Walton Road, Frinton-on-Sea, Essex. Or telephone us on 0255 67 6252.